So what was in the box? Let's find out, shall we? Silver Steeler here. And winning image photography. So I had a vid that premiered the other day that was called My Biggest Silver Buy. And a couple days before when I talked about it, it was a vid called What's in the Box. And it was actually a two-stop visit during the course of that day. So I had work that night, but before work, I stopped in and picked up a few things. He only had three American Silver Eagles. And I picked up a roll of dimes, almost full roll of quarters, constitutional, an empty tube. That way he has to fill it. A simple proof 40% candidate, some fake eagles and gold that I was going to use for a video. And then these we got that night at 12 o'clock, but I'm going to exclude them from this video right now. This might excite Silver Surfer some. I'll do a video later on, the, on this when I have done more research. And uh, oh, look, a copper Chinese round from the Dragon series. So, and then these two I purchased that night too. These are all future vids. I'm not gonna get into that stuff right now. What this video is gonna be about is the random amount of years that we got in those five tubes. And of course, this whole row are 1996s. So let's break them out. So what we're gonna do is open these five rolls and see what the dates are on all these. We have sort of looked through them before, didn't we? On that night we got home, we searched just to make sure there were no 96s. There was no 96s. And uh, we noticed that they came in a lot of times groups of 10. Like I said, I had been there earlier that day and he only had three to sell me. These three right in front. And we got a 2004. A 2003, and a 2012. So I'm just going to remove these three for now because, believe it or not, I think there isn't an older date in any of those five tubes that we picked up that night, right? Everything's younger. I think 2001 or 2000 that we noticed were in there. There are a lot of 1990s. And there's even a bunch of 89s in here, we think. So we're going to just do like a little inventory now. You know, I know a lot of you wanted to know what the breakdown of what I got random years was. That was the only thing that wasn't really answered on that video that night. Because we just did the purchase of it. So we're going to sort of inventory this now. And I know I got a couple rolls already of the six that I had that I need to go through. There's some random dates in there. So this is going to be able to let us stack all the years together in the tubes the best that we can, so, right? That's pretty much the purpose of this vid. So why don't we just get the first one out? All at once, woo! I'm getting better at it. So she's gonna keep a little track sheet over there. We'll see how we go about this. This is gonna be a 98. So I'm gonna make a little Tab for 98 over there. 98. 98. 98. Probably going to be 10 of these, I would guess. That's what we were seeing that night. 98. Ninety-eight. 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 Hmm. Ninety-eight. Ninety-nine. Make sure that last one was definitely 98. It was. So now we go to 99. So it looks like. I 
There should be 1098s there. There are. So, you got that. Let's get one out of here. Go like this. Put the pile right beside it. Or behind it. Or behind it. Let's just do that. The ones in the slabs there, by the way, are the 96s that I had. There's 10 of those. We'll get one of those out of the slabs a little later. Take a closer look at it. So 10 98s. I'd imagine these other 10 are going to be 99s, but let's take a look at them. 99. 99. Beautiful too. They're all in fantastic shape. 99. 99. 99. 99. Beautiful. They're in fantastic shape. 99 99 99 and yes another last 99 to complete 10 so that tube was a tube of 98 10 of them and 10 99s just to be sure 5 and 5 Now we saw some 89s in there. Those things looked fantastic, didn't they? Yeah, they were. They were so clean and shiny. I can't wait to get to that tube. So let's pick another one. Let's go for this one. That looked pretty shiny on top there. That might be the one. All right. Let's see what we got here. 1990. That thing's a blazer. Look at that. Now, like I said, I didn't think we had anything older than 2002. Another 1990. So there just might be 10 of these. Look at these ones. They shine. Blazers. Beautiful. Another 1990. Probably going to be 10 of these. 1990. These ones are gorgeous too. Thought the 89s look good. These 90s look good. Oh well, there we go. Now something's different. A 94. So only had four of the 90s. Now we got a 94. So let's just break this whole tube down before we make any labels for them. There's a 94. A 95. All right. It's not really getting in the shot there. Can you flip those back? Yeah, let's back that up a little bit. Now you can see the piles a little bit better. A 95, another 95, little Tony going on in that one there, 95, a 97, so we have our fourth different year in this tube now. A 97. A 
This one's a little bit some milk spot and stuff going on this one, but hey, 97. 97 a 97 97 huh another 97 looks like the 10 of them might be the 97s in that too because here's another 97 97 and 97 so I bet you it's going to be 10 97s yep 10 97s would appear to be 4 95s 2 94s and 4 1990s that was a little bit different. All right, I'll brush this table up a little bit. I'll be right back. All right, so we're two rolls in. And we got three to go. So we've got, at this point, two rolls in, four 1990s, two 94s, four 95s, 1097s, 1098s, and 1099s. Yep, so... You are correct, sir. This is sort of cool. We we knew a little bit what we had in there, but we wanted to get it. Well, we got home at 4 o'clock in the morning and went to bed at 5 because we peeked at some of the stuff and fed the cats. And it was a long night. It was a long night. So let's do another tube. Uh oh. Uh, get them all. Over. Yep. All right. Let's see what we got going on in this roll. So we got 93. We got a 93. Another 93. Beautiful. Another 93. Ninety-three. So that's five. Ninety-three. There's a good chance we'll have 10 of these and the way that things have been hanging out. Oh, there it is. There's the 89. See what I mean about those 89s? One of them caught my eye that night when we were looking through them. They are just... Man. They shine. Don't they? <laughs> Bling. Big time. I believe, I think we got 10 of those. So let's see. 89 another 89 and 89 yeah I mean every one of these 89s look at those things just shine. Another 89. Whew. 89. So, yeah. Gonna have 10 of those 89s probably, and that's great. Each one of them just bling. This one's got a little mark right there on the side. Below the Y a little bit. I don't know what that is, but it doesn't really matter. It's playing the rest of it. it just shines like crazy, like all the others. So another 89. 
bling. Yeah, I believe the 89s were the shiniest in this whole batch. And there's another 93. So we're back to getting the 93s on that side. How many was that for the 89s? We got nine. Nine? Really? I'll have to double check that. Yeah. Here's a 93. Yeah, it's probably 10. 93. 93. Yeah, I bet it's 10. You missed one one time. Well, I was looking at the bling. <laughs> yeah, there's 1089s there. 1089s and 1093s, right? That's what I'm seeing. Right. So, let's get them in the lineup here. Looks like we got room over here for... We'll be a little bit out of order. Well, no, we'll put the 89s there. Those are beautiful, those 89s. Just gorgeous. So now we're three tubes in, two to go. And 93 will have to be a little bit out of order. Unless we put it there, like right in front of the 94. Let's put it. They weren't as pretty, those 93s, as those 89s. I don't, I don't want to block the 94. It's still there. Barely get this one in. Say this right there. All right. Let's get her a little bit off her side. We're going to run out of room here soon, probably. Okay. Three down. Two tubes to go. So... I made the mistake last time I had my gloves off in between the cuts. So we're what? 1089s, 490s, 294s, 495s, 1097s, 8s, and 9s, and 93s. Yeah, that's our count so far. So let's hope for a whole nother different year. Yeah. The streak is reborn. Shiny. What have we here? All right, I'm ready to jot them down. Oh, it's a ninety-four. Ninety-four. Mm-hmm. We have some ninety-fours back there already. Two of them. There's a ninety-two. So another different year that we haven't gotten so far. A 92, a 92, another 92, another 92. These are in pretty good shape too. Beautiful. Mm-hmm. 92. Look at the luster on that. Beautiful for how old they are, you know. Now, I remember in that video, when we were there that night, he said there were some 86s in here. We haven't gotten to them yet. 92. 92. So it looks like we're probably going to have 10 of those. <laughs> I don't mind that if they all look like that. Beautiful. Remember, these were all purchased, $17.25 a piece. On what night was that? July 10th? When spot was right around 1530-ish. 91. So another first different year. How many did those 92s we end up having? There's nine here. Huh. Maybe there's one further down the tube. What year was that one? 91. Hmm. And here's another 91. Ninety-one. So that's the third ninety-one. Ninety-one. Now, I mean we'll talk about random years. 
never get this off one of the major dealers. I like that. It's another 91. What do you got on there? Five? Yes. 91. Ninety one. Ninety one. Ninety one. All right, which one's gonna last one here? Be ten, and which one's gonna be nine? Ninety one. So we have ten of those, and only nine in the ninety twos. And what one? The other one being a ninety four. Yes. That was weird. Yeah. Really weird. So get me one out. A tag for 91 and 92. It's too bad. Those 92s are really looking good, too. Better. So this makes the third 94. Put that one in 94 pile. And... We'll get those lined right up here. All right. One roll left. I expect to find some 86s in here. So where we're at right now is... 1089s, three, no, four 90s, three 94s, four 95s, 1097s, 1098s, 1099s, 1091s, nine 92s, and 1093s. Pretty right. random. Yeah, pretty random so far for four tubes. And now I expect to find some 80. Sixes in here. Yeah. I know he said that that night when we picked up these five ones. There's a 94. So we do have what? Three 94s over there? Mm -hmm. Now four of them. 94. Yeah, it's got that spot all the way at the top there. Not the prettiest of ones, but for the most part, these have all been BU condition. Beautiful 94. 94s, none of them have really looked that awesome. There's a 94. And again, it's got all that spotting around the middle there. Big time. Another 94. One of the better ones, although up there on her arm, there's a good spot there. 94. Oops. There it is. There's an 86. So we got our first 86. First year. That's sweet. That's cool. You got to jot it down? You do. There's another 86 with some toning going on in the 2 o'clock area. Where's the spot? No, that's a little toning going on. Beautiful shape. Oop. 86. So, yeah. It'd be nice to have five to ten of these first year. Did you jot it down? You did. 86 again. These are sweet. Beautiful. What a random year. Five, five roll tube. It's very nice to be searching through the one out silver rounds not knowing what years you really got. Another 86. It's going to be five of them so far. 87. So another... New year. New year. That's beautiful. 87 is better than the 86s were. Look at that. Let's see. Another 87. Gorgeous. Another 87, so we're at least probably going to have five of these, I would think. Eighty-seven. Well, 
beautiful shape. 87. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. There's cartwheeling. Ah, 88. So what would have we have? Five of the 80, 86s, five of the 87s. Or are those two of 94s? Oh no, there's more than that. 94s. Alright, so here's the 88. Another 88. And last but not least, a 2000. The only, that's the only time we had any year of 2000. The very last coin I pulled out of the fifth roll. That was weird. So, everything else was. How many coins were there? Oh, that was five rolls, 100. So 99 of those coins were under the year 2000. This was the only one that was 2000. was the last one we pulled out. That was pretty weird. So, yeah, I mean, you can't beat that. Just tagging these out here real quick. There's a 2000. The 98s were, well, it wasn't a 98, babe. It was in 88, 87, 86, and uh, 94s. 94s had homes back here. And then 88 is right here. 87 right here, and then we had, what was it? 86 I needed. 1986. So there's the breakdown. Wow. You want to... I used every piece of paper. That's 1886. If we had a silver <laughs> eagle like that, now you need to make it a nine. Oh, now no, I you, ru paper. you ruined it. You ruined it. It's going to be ugly. 1886. We'd have so much money there. There's the ugly a new one. design. There's the ugly 1986 one. So, yeah. All right, so we're going to wrap this one up. We've done the math a few times, and we discovered... <laughs> We We're got 99 eagles. 99 eagles out of those five tubes. So <laughs> I'm sure it was a pure mistake. He called me right after he got it. He'll he'll give me another one. I ain't worried about it, honestly. So the ending total on all that was 1089s, 490s, 1094s, 495s, 1097s, 8s, and 9s, 1091s, 992s. That would be the one I wish I had that 100th of. 1093s, 586s, 587s, 288s, and a year 2000 to bring 99. But that's okay. Like I said earlier in the day when I had my three, this is why you always go and pick up a few more extra eagles when you can. It was really weird because when I got there earlier in the day, all I had were these three eagles. And believe it or not, I think these ones cost me $18 each because it just didn't have any. And then he went and sold me all those others you see, the 99 of them. Well, really 100. But he sold those to me for $17.25 a piece. So I did have a 2012, a 2003 again, and 2004. So a pretty good sweet pickup. Now, I spent $1,725 on the five rolls. Right? Yeah. Yep. And then for the 86s, I went ahead and got one of these out. Those are the ones that you see slabbed over here. He sold these to me for $30 a piece. And we then there were nine of them. We got nine of those, but there was a tenth one that he went in the back room and got that had a fingerprint on it and it was just a tiny little uh, mark smudgy. on the front. Smudgy mark on the front. He sold that to me for 20 bucks. There's the 96s. And, you know, whoever had them, sold them to him first, obviously knew what they had because they all came, you know, I mean, they're not slabbed by a company. They were just self-slabbed. I got these, too. They're usually these B BCW slabs. They're actually made in a town right next to me. And I've got a video on that, too. So there you go. 
That was a sweet pickup. I spent what then uh, 290 bucks on the 10 1996s. So there's the breakdown of it all. That is a random pile of eagles. I mean, I don't know if that'll happen again like that. Well, maybe with him, you never know. But I've now pretty much have resigned myself to only getting eagles off this guy. I mean, why, why would I go anywhere else? He hasn't given me a surcharge on my credit card. I earn points on my credit card. You know, it's just an all-around real, really good deal. So who knows what, you know, I'm probably paying way less than seventeen twenty-five per eagle by the time I get my points back. Not a ton less, but what? Nothing. What? What did I, just, I say? No, it wasn't you. I was just thinking about Curtis, how he hates making mistakes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He'll get us back on that eagle. I'm not concerned about that at all. Like I said, that guy... We'll be doing some segments with him here, hopefully in September, because uh, he's got a very, very interesting mind. Well, anyway, there's the breakdown of those five rolls of eagles that I got on the video. My biggest buy of silver to date, or something like that. I think my biggest buy, my biggest silver buy. So in total that night, I spent 2100 bucks, and then earlier in the day, I'd spent 180 bucks. So that whole day, I spent about 2300 bucks with him and I'll have some more follow-up videos of the other items that I bought in the near future well that's it for this one thanks for stopping by thanks for those that stopped by during the premiere and watched through the whole boring video hopefully it was a little bit entertaining I think it was yeah, nice set of random years there I mean you won't get that from an Atmax Jam Bullion ST Bullion you just won't I mean if you ordered five rolls you might get you know, 20 of one year and 20 of another year, where they could all be five rolls of 2019s or 2013s, and chances are that's probably how it's going to be from what I've been seeing. I, I watch a lot of videos out there of people buying full rolls, and rare, rarely do you ever see one where they got some random years in it. So your LCS is the way to go. And but, he can give you deals, especially if you are a customer that comes in... On a regular basis. On a regular basis and buys uh, more than a few eagles at a time get a good rapport with them i mean that's the best thing you do i mean and th this guy's now my friend so and it's awesome having a friend who uh cuts your deals on coins so well everyone thanks for stopping by silver stealer here winning image here remember to like subscribe and all those good things other good things <laughs> <laughs> she's supposed to know it we'll see you on the next video Silver Steeler here. Hi everyone, when you need photography. <laughs> hey everyone, Silver Steeler here. And winning image photography. So in the video, my biggest silver buy and perm uh, uh, Yeah. Silver Steeler here. And winning image photography. So the other day I premiered a vid. Uh, my biggest silver buy, and the vid before that was what was in the box. And there was a lot more items in the box than when you first saw the, um, I'm like, gosh, I can't do that.